Last week we planned a picnic from Morfur right, to a place very near Wadu. My brother and I joined our cousin in his force group Taji and we set off from Pedura towards Wadu. If you've been to Wagaman, you know that the roads uh, leading towards Wagaman are pretty narrow uh, and there is quite a bit of traffic on this way. So the going is not very quick, but it's a nice drive. As you get closer to Wagaman, the scenery uh, becomes a lot more enjoyable and the roadsides are a lot more green making it a really nice uh, drive along this uh, narrow route. Somewhere along this road, we turned off onto an awful track. This track requires uh, you to have an uh, 4 into 4 Jeep because no other vehicle will actually go through this part. After about 10 minutes, we joined back onto uh, a much smoother trail and uh, it is possible to bring bikes along this path because we did see a number of bikers also on top. After about 10 minutes of driving along this track, we reached uh, the top and as you can see from uh, the visuals, the scenery from here was quite spectacular. Right at the top you get a panoramic view of the entire region uh, and bang opposite you get uh, Nice sighting of Ilikilkal, which is a peak that's right opposite where we stand, uh, which one can go trekking on, uh, and I'm hoping to go there sometime. But the rest of the region and all the mountains of the Western Ghats uh, in this region are visible from this point, and it's quite a spectacular sight. After some preliminary exploration of the region, we decided to uh, sit down and enjoy a picnic basket with a little bit of music and with the awesome scenery all around, it was quite breathtaking. Uh, I set up a time lapse just to capture the cloud movement over the region, which you can see here. Once the sun set, there were spectacular views of the city night lights around as well as huge amount of fireflies which is really breathtaking and it was really an awesome sight before we had to get back down. <laughs> <laughs> 